he walks. As you can hear the automobile sounds, the airplane overhead, a man, a poet walks. He walks to walk off all the aggression, all the animosity, all the pain that's coursing inside him. But that's really a lie. He walks in the cold. So his eyes will realize that the tears that fall, they won't dry. I'll never understand how we come close to the apex, close to the moment where all the work, all the perseverance finally pay off. And you do like I'm doing right now. You walk it off. My melancholy obvious. You can hear it by the pitch and tone of my voice. So the tears fall. Because they really have no choice. No choice at all. People are stopping and staring at me, wondering what's wrong with me, because I walk aimlessly. People are stopping and staring. Looking. As I'm walking aimlessly. I ignore them. I know all the sounds. I know all the glares. <laughs> I'm used to that. And simply put, instead of me walking Gotham, rather a place called Chicago in the middle of a winter, as you can feel the as you can feel the breath coming from my mouth. I should be coming to where you at. But I'm not. So I walk. I walk the cold so the tears know. <laughs> I walk the cold so the tears know that in this cold they will not dry. But my heart, I wear it on my sleeve as if it was a shirt. So my emotions, they don't lie. So I walk in the cold.